This is David Hantner. I'm the conductor of the Portland Youth Philharmonic, and I would like to help you understand what an audition for the Portland Youth Philharmonic is like. It's really very simple, particularly for those of you who play wind and brass instruments. We need to hear a major scale with an arpeggio, a minor scale with an arpeggio, a short solo or a portion of a solo, and a little sight reading. Most of our auditions are going to be by video this year, so the sight reading you'll be sent something about 24 hours before your audition is due and you'll be able to look it over and include it as part of your recording. We'd like you to record your audition video straight through and although you can take as many tries at the entire thing as you want, just send us the best one that you have. A lot of people are worried that everyone who auditions for the Portland Youth Philharmonic is extremely advanced already. That's not necessarily the case. We hear a lot of people who are in the process of becoming, and our idea is to help you improve quickly and efficiently with the way we run our program. But let's just talk about the audition for now, and we'll give you some tips on how to prepare on another video. So the first thing you want to do is announce yourself and tell us what scales you will be playing. My name is David Hatner. I'm going to be playing scales and arpeggios in G major and E minor. <laughs> play those for you because that's a good tempo to play scales so that we really know that you can play them cleanly um, with air flowing steadily throughout the entire process and um, that that you're well aware of uh, the need to, for it to sound like a routine. As for the minor scale that was the melodic version you can play the harmonic version you can play the natural version I advise you to go to our website and download the scale packet for your instrument. We have them for all the winds and brass instruments, which will include the entire range of your instrument and go as high as you can go or as low as you can go and use that because it will be an aid to you. Then you will announce your solo. I'm going to be playing the Weber concertino for clarinet. I'm going to start after the introduction at the theme. probably play another minute or two for your audition and then you would go to the sight reading you don't need to say anything just play it down and then send it to us via Google via YouTube however you want to send it and we will get back to you quickly as we can with an official result and it may turn out that we will want to hear you play a live audition at some point but for now that's the basics on playing or submitting an audition, and we'll talk more about preparing it in the next video.